All right, hello everybody. Travis Chandler at Chandler Gaming back here with the next episode of the Soldier series of Mass Effect. Before we get in the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications for to be notified of all my future videos. That being said, let's get down to it. So today, I'm thinking we're going to go to um, Pharos. I'm thinking, yep, that's what we're doing. Yep. Okay. Yep, that's where we're going. screensaver you know I would love to have the um the mass relay give me a sec here my glasses yeah I'll be right back everyone all right I'm back everyone sorry about that I can see now I had to wash my glasses just drives me nuts when there's like dust and shit on my glasses I mean it just it draws my eye you know if I had the money I'd be buying premium glasses not just these cheapy ones Okay, we're ready to go. I think. Let me take a look at the equipment. Yeah, I better empty out the equipment too. I'll keep those. I'll keep those. Sledgehammer will keep. Right. Frictionless material. We need. Okay. Good. Damn it, there's more on my glasses too, son of a bitch. There. 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 Give me one more sec. Losing my pants here. There we go. There we go. That's better. I 
I'm losing weight, it seems. That's probably what why I keep losing my pants. It's just I'm losing weight. Which is a good thing. Looking for supplies? Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. Sell all junk. You... save the Polaris there nothing worth a shit okay how much money I got more than enough all right now we can go on Pharos Okay. You see me using the R and Tally all the time? It's because I like having a balanced team. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Okay, what the fuck? Why? No? Okay. Okay. There. We saw your ship. Fidan wants to speak with you immediately. Who's Fidan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the Geth. They are making another push. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. Notice I'm just taking these guys out like they're nothing. It's crazy how powerful, how overpowered you can get in this game. Boom, I got him. There we go. That was a good grenade. Make sure they're secure. But what if I find Geth there? Okay. So we need to go talk to Fidan first before we can unlock anything. Oh, Commander. I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. 
Everyone's on edge, sis. Watch out! We've got gas in the tower! Protect the heart of the colony! Heads up! Nice job, Pally. We leveled up, so we'll get the level up real quick. What were we working on with Shepard? Um. Maybe fitness? And you, we were working on barrier. And you, we got hacking done. We'll do damping. Okay, so if you come all the way back here, you get some free items. Now we need to go back and talk to Phi Dan, and then they'll say, oh, well, there's uh, people in the colony that need help, too, and so we'll help them, too, because we're a nice guy and all. <laughs> You could skip it if you want and just go straight to the Skyway from here, but, um, well, I know you got to talk to Fight Ann first and then you get to go to the Skyway, but, um, we're going to talk to everyone. The tower's secure, thanks to you, Commander. I'm just glad your colony is safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. Help me find what the Geth are after, and you'll all get out of here alive. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. How do I get there? The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. I didn't expect this would be easy. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. We'll get going then. Good luck, Commander. Okay. So if you investigate, um, by the end, I'll tell you all the problems that are wrong with the colony. I know where they all are, so I'm just going to skip that and just talk to them. You're the one who repelled that last wave. They'll be back. And if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Varen meat, but it's too dangerous. The Alpha Varen, he's huge and he's mad. Rabid, maybe. Totally uncontrollable. I can't do anything until he's dead. I have to go. So long, Commander. Okay. Commander, I was told to make my supplies available to you, if you wish. Let me see what you have. 
Of course. I may be able to provide a few interesting items. By interesting item, he just means his frickin' license. You know? Nice work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. If I find anything while I'm looking around, I'll send it your way. Thank you, Commander. I appreciate it. I'm sorry, but I can't stop to talk. I have to deal with the water shortage. Is there anything I can do? The utilities building was one of the first to fall under Geth control. Find the mains and turn them back on. Until then, this colony is dry. I have to go. I wish you luck. Okay. So you have to talk to everyone to get the quests. And I do it so I can get the experience. I think you get Paragon for it too, but I'm not sure. Commander, what can I do for you? What can you tell me about the defenses the Geth have set up? I don't have any details, but I'll wager it's a lot more fortified than the command post. They landed at least one Geth ship at Exogeny, and I've seen large walking tanks on the Skyway. Expect a hard fight. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Okay. So now, we come back upstairs. Here's where you get to the Skyway. But we're not going there yet. We're going to come over here and we're going to do all these quests. Oh God! They're nice job, Tally. All right. Bam, we just took him out like they're nothing. The system has not yet activated. I do not believe we are finished yet. We're not yet. There's three valves total. Oh, I got them both in one shot. Snuck up on me. Oh, there he is. Okay, I thought he flew over. Took care of those Krogan like they were nothing. But here's one of the... Ooh, a kinetic coil and frictionless material. But here's one of the quests right here. Just destroy this tower. Alright. So we'll... Go to that for you. That for you. There. Make sure it's destroyed. It is. Okay. Alright. Now we come across the way here, and in that door, that's where we'll find the Baron.
Nice job. Hell yeah. Then you come up here and get the power cells. And that's almost all the quests. Ooh, a Colossus IX for Rex. Nice, we're keeping that. Always check your boxes, you never know what you're gonna find. Kinetic exoskeleton, that's for Tally maybe. Boom, there you go. Okay, the last valve right there. There! That did it! The system is active. Blow him to fucking kingdom come. You don't want to go down there. What are you doing down here? Nothing I should be, and anything I shouldn't. No! Ah! That was a good one. Very intense. What's the matter with you? Just invoking the master's whip. Helps remind me I'm still alive. You're here for the geth, aren't you? You're not the only one interested in those things. Who else is looking for the geth? Not looking for. Looking to get rid of. They're a thorn in the side of the- ah! I'm trying to get to the- Dying! <laughs> this one is no longer fit. We should leave him. Is there anything I can do to help you? Do you even want help? Help me? No. No one can help me now. I'd rather- Die fighting! Fighting what? Not that kind of fight. It's like running through a thorn bush. The more you struggle, time's up. Company's coming. Ask Fidan. Ask him about the. Ah! Look out! So now it's just a straight run back to fight in. But we'll be fighting enemies along the way, too. <laughs> Shot down in a blaze of glory. I'm just so overpowered for this. That's what makes this funny. I'm just so overpowered for this. Okay. We'll pass the Skyway elevator. Down these steps. And then we'll talk to everyone to turn our quests in. Commander, what can I do for you? I destroyed a Geth transmitter in the tunnels. It won't be a problem any longer. Thank you, Commander. We're in your debt. You've taken a great weight off my shoulders. I just wish I had such good news for every problem. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Okay. Now we go in here. Hello again, Commander. 
I killed the big Varen. The rest are yours. Excellent. I'll organize a hunt when the immediate threat of the Geth is gone. I have to go. Here, for your trouble. It's not much I know, but it's all we can spare. Nice work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Here, Fidan gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Now if I can kick these power cells into place, I'll have this colony up and running in no time. The water started running not long ago. Thanks to you, I assume. Now we just need to deal with the Geth and we can get back to growing this colony. Here, a few credits for your trouble. Thank you again, Commander. All right, so now we got everything turned in. Now we can head on down the pathway to the Skyway. Commander, what can I do for you? There's a guy living down in the tunnels. Is he one of yours? That would be Ian. He's very sick. He seems to be more than just sick. He hasn't been the same since the attack. We tried to help him, but he wouldn't listen to us. I can't help my people if they won't listen, Commander. Don't you have medical supplies? Something to help him? I wish it was that simple. Ian was a good man I'd like to have with us. Please, Commander. I'd prefer not to talk about it anymore. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Okay. Oh, not close enough. There we go. And that's how you do that. And now to the guest base. Not something an intelligent being would typically say. Right? The last batch went south. What are they looking for? We are receiving a weak comm signal. I cannot do one this location. Yes. There we go. We just leveled up again. Um, fitness is what I think I'm gonna do for Shepard. For Liara, we might do Singularity. I think. And damping for... Pally, there we go. More chatter, Commander Shepard. I still can't get a fix on the location. Any sign of movement? Brisbane could still be in there. It's only been a few days. She's my daughter. I'll wait as long as I have to. Oh, is there one up here we missed? There is. There we go. But down we go here. Blow his head off. A savant! Omni tool! A nice find indeed! Hell yeah! That goes to freaking Liara. Or not Liara, but, um, Tally. 
And Liara gets her kinetic exoskeleton. Right, Tally, dealing with the Geth is more important, but we do want to talk to these people. That's close enough. Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? Commander Shepard, I'm here to remove your Geth problem. You see? You worry too much. And you trust too easily, Juliana. I'm just glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. Fidan and some of the members of Zoo's Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. I said they were probably all dead. They're surviving despite everything the Geth have done to them. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. I'll do whatever I can to keep them away from me. But I need some information. What kind of information? Ignore him. The Geth are up in the Exogeny headquarters, just a bit further along the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. I'm not interested in your company's secrets. Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We can do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. That's my daughter you're talking about. She's still alive. I know it. Where is your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. For a short time. If she's in there, I'll get her out. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the Geth are after. Of course. And please remember, if you see my daughter... I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. What do you need? I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Sounds easy enough. What's the catch? No catch, really. It's dangerous work, but not for someone like you. What is it about you that makes people assume we enjoy being in harm's way? Right? It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. I hate the turn here. There we go. Huh, that was weird. I wonder why that rolled. Okay, we got one more get to kill. I kill them all so I can get the experience. Ugh. And back in the Mako we go. Wait, shut down the car. We've got incoming get. 
shut down the comms! With these high explosive rounds, you can shoot into cover and you can, um, you can kill the enemies by shooting into cover like that. There it is. Boom. See? Like that. For some reason, these high explosive rounds, they go through cover. So really, you don't even have to watch your shots, but you have to be careful when it comes to, um, when it comes to later, and I'll, I won't spoil anything until later. Those that may not have seen the last series, I, I won't spoil anything, so... Kill you. Kill you. Open the door. We want to turn around. Be extremely heavy once we are inside. There we go. All right, we'll come in this locked door. Okay. Ooh, a medical exoskeleton. We need to equip that. You need to sabotage. You need to warp. A one way trip down, Commander Shepard. Drop down here to move on. Or one of those Varen. You're safe now. But why were you here in the first place? It's my own fault. Everyone else was running, and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on, and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. We'll get you out, as soon as we find out what the Geth are after. It's not the Geth, it's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... I'm here for the Geth. It's very important I find out what they're after. I don't know for certain, but I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. Thorian? What is that exactly? It's an indigenous life form. Exogeny was studying it. What else can you tell me? Do you know where I can find this Thorian? I... I might be able to, but not with those Geth crawling around everywhere. Look, we need to get out of here, past that field. Do you know how we can shut it down? No, not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. 
You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. All right. I'll look into it. Stay put until the field is down. Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice. I'll just find a small hole to hide in until the field is down. Oh, here, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck with that field. There we go. Stupid machine. Access encrypted bomb. No, I don't want to review protocol. I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with- STUPID MACHINE! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, Research Assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of Subject Species 37, the Thorian. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What does Zoo's Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That explains their strange behavior. Your pilot should be warned. Joker! Come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. We must find a way around the field. We must get back to Zoo's Hope. V.I., what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. We need to find that ship. Let's get moving. Going to standby mode. Okay, so here we go. Okay, there we go.
Okay, so we want to go up th these stairs first. Here it is. All right. Open the security node, get into this locker. Here's the uh, data that Gavin Hossel was asking us for. So now we go back down the steps and we go in this room over here. This is where we're supposed to go. And up these steps. Okay, open up these terminals. We'll get something interesting out of them. So we get a quest for another star system. Same as before, we don't have the ordinance to blow this claw. Let's keep looking. Even one claw and that ship will fall. Okay. Open up this security, this server node to uh, learn something else for another quest. Cerberus was paying people from Exogeny to um, give them samples of the Thorian. So this is easy to do. Um, you need to get the pressure up between 30 and 34, or 31 and 34. If you go over, it won't work. This is easy to do. Just do a little math. And that's how you do that. Barring the exit will be down. Now we can go deal with the Thorian creature. I hope that ship was full of those Geth bastards. I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. They can't do any real damage. We're on our way back. Just hold your position. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right here for you, Commander. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. 
Okay. Well, we get the hell out of here. And we did level up now that I'm thinking about it. We'll take this. We missed it on the way up. Okay, and so here's where the energy field was. So we come out this way. I don't think this place is safe. I need some answers. You knew more about the Thorian than you let on. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. When the Geth attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I... I, I never meant for this to happen. You did what you could. I'll help them, if you can tell me where to find the Thorian. The Thorian is underneath Zeus Hope, but the entrance is blocked. The colonists covered it with the freighter just before the Geth attacked. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. That's what Exergeny was interested in. Normandy to shore party, come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm chatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to help. Undo the mess I helped create. Okay. So now we go all the way back across the Skyway. This is why I turn around the uh, Mako so I don't have to on the way out. I can just get in and go. We don't need to stop and get out. We can just ride straight there and just kill the Geth on the way, so... Okay, so we come back down here, figure out what's going on here. You can't do this, John. <laughs> Everyone shut up. Uh, let me think. What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard, damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. <laughs> I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogeny database. I know what you did during the Blitz, but your heroics aren't needed here. We can talk this out. Nobody needs to get hurt. You, you don't understand. It's not that easy. 
Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, Jong. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. You're after the one unique thing Pharos has. The Thorian. The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus' hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, Jong. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. Can't you see the inherent potential in this colony? Think of the promotional opportunities. Opportunities? What the hell are you talking about? They recovered from an alien attack on a frontier world. Add that to your company profile. Well, yeah. No one's ever gone broke playing the champion of humanity card. Sadly, you'd probably make a killing. But if it will let us get back to our lives, I'm for it. It just might work. Wait, no, but the infected colonists will throw a bit of a wrench in that plan. No, no, they need to disappear. You can't just kill the colonists. It's not their fault. If you kill only the Thorian, it might be enough to stop the infection. Maybe. It's worth a try, but I don't know if I can avoid harming the colonists. There has to be another way. Maybe there is. Come and talk to me before you leave, Commander. Just make sure there's no evidence when you're done. Okay. Any luck finding my workstation out in the ruins? I managed to find the data and transfer it to your OSD. That's very good news indeed, thank you. I was there anyway. It was the least I could do. Well, I appreciate it. Here. You certainly earned this. Thanks again, Commander. Okay. I'm glad you've decided to help us. I think there's a way to avoid killing the colonists. What did you have in mind? I think you could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. Releasing clouds of nerve gas doesn't seem like a particularly good idea. It's not like it's weapons grade. The insecticide we use in the grow labs contains trace amounts of tetraclopine, a neuromuscular degenerator. If their nervous systems are already weakened, it may act as a paralyzing agent. A reduced capacity concussion grenade might suit our needs. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. Okay, so now we need to put on the anti-thorian grenades. We'll do that now because we're going to save the colonists. It's not easy to do. It's not really tough, but it's not easy to do either. I have saved all the colonists before. You're not dead? I thought you were. He was playing dead. a human to that extent. I wonder what is going on here. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. As you order, Commander Shepard. Okay. So watch your shots.
So now... And we got those two, okay. So far, so good. want to go slowly through all this. You don't want to just plow through this if you're going to save the colonists. You want to draw the Thorian Creepers as far back as you can. You do not want to see two of the fucking colonists just got killed. It's why I said, um, this isn't the easiest thing to do. See, somebody just hit those colonists, fuckers. Okay, and down these steps to finish off Pharos. We just need to find this creature and determine what it... What it... Kila. What is that? That does not look like any plant I've ever seen. This may be problematic. Gee, you think, Shepard? transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. 
The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them, now! No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Your blood will be the ground in this room. There's the node. That had the desired effect, I believe. A few more and it will be severely hurt. Two shots on that one, that's nice. We just leveled up. We'll deal with the level up. Open this up. There we go. We are killing the Thorian. Boy, boy.
Really? Hope it's blown. There we go. Finally he's dead. I should thank you for releasing me. Is everything all right? Are you hurt? I am fine, or I will be, in time. My name is Shiala. I serve, I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. Benezia sought to turn the river and was swept away. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of his existence. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the Cypher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. I need that knowledge to stop Saren. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity.
I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. What was that? Commander Shepard, are you all right? I saw... something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. We should get you back to the ship where you can be monitored. I am sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the- Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. I can't believe it. Jong says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Okay. So now we gotta get out of here. Why they make you walk all the way back to the ship, I don't know, but they do. It's so stupid. Return to the Normandy so we can do the debrief. Then I'm gonna have to call it for this video. <laughs> Commander, you look pale. Are you suffering any ill effects from the Cypher? The Cypher shook me up a bit. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we can make some sense of it. Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity! <laughs> Incredible. All this time, all my research, yet I... I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so... intense. You are remarkably strong-willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Come on, get to the point. What did you see? The beacon on Eden Prime must have been badly damaged. Large parts of the vision are... are missing. The data transferred into the Commander's mind is incomplete. You must have seen something. I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision. What was there, at least. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can... I can... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. We're done here. Dismissed. I've sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander, Exogeny should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. 
You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. The Thorian liked to enslave minds. Anyone who studied it would have ended up as one of its thralls. Perhaps it's for the best, then. At least the colony was saved. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help a human colony. Being human had nothing to do with it. They were in trouble. Admirable. But sometimes Spectres have to make sacrifices. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. Goodbye, Commander. We will be waiting for your next report. Okay. Well, like I said, I'm going to have to call it for this video. So I hope you all had fun this episode. I did. And I'll see you all in the next episode where we move on and head on to Burmire.